All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So you might've noticed this morning that Global got a pretty substantial data download along with the uh, app update. So in this video, we're gonna find out exactly what was included in this 500 megabyte plus data download, okay? Now, real quick, before we get into it, I wanna give a shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all these assets. This video would not be possible without him. So if you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. And uh, with that said, let's scroll down a bit and check everything out. So first things first, we have some assets for the new Is LR Trunks Extreme Z Battle Event slash Extreme Z Awakening. There is the logo along with the trunks himself, the cut-ins and all that stuff. We have the TUR trunks here, and uh, also the Extreme Z Awakening medal for the LR trunks as well. Later today, I do plan to um, do a live stream for the Extreme Z battle event, so make sure to uh, tune in for that if you guys can. And from there, we have the Extreme Z Awakening medal for the Prime Battle uh, AGL LR trunks, so two LR trunks Extreme Z Awakenings now available in the game. Now this guy takes uh, quite a bit of effort because you need six different units to be rainbowed and fully Extreme Z Awakened. So uh, I don't think I can actually do this one today, but we'll probably stream the setup either tonight or sometime tomorrow. So yeah, that is the Prime Battle Trunks Extreme Z Awakening. And then we have some new Extreme Z area stages for the free to play Android 13. Extreme Z Awakening along with the uh, free to play 14 and 15 Extreme Z Awakening as well. And after that, we have a new Extreme Z, or sorry, a new Explosive Chain Battle boss, which is going to be King Cold. He's the next Explosive Chain Battle boss on Global. And uh, we also have some new 40th World Tournament cards. So this baby right here, the Youth Form baby, is the uh, new reward unit. And then we also have this AGL Piccolo who is gonna be summonable on the DB Saga. Uh, this is Piccolo Jr, by the way, uh, DB Saga um, banner. And we also have the Token Awakening for the Int Android 18, who I am personally very, very excited for. And uh, you know, your standard World Tournament banners, we have like the ticket banner promo, we have the new, uh, you know, unit promo, uh, some more banners and stuff like that. Pretty standard stuff for your world tournaments. Nothing too crazy there. And okay, so these guys, before you get too excited, are untranslated at the moment. So the reason this data download was so uh, big, it was because, you know, they included a bunch of data that is not ready for release yet, but we'll be getting them on global very soon. So. Uh, we have the assets for the, uh, I think it's Int, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, or, you know, he transforms into Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and he's part of the Dual Dokkan Fest with this guy right here, which is the STR Kid Buu. So that Dual Dokkan Fest will be dropping on Global probably in April, I would say, most likely, because we have the Saiyan Day stuff coming up, right? So Saiyan Day first, and then after that, we'll be getting this dual Dokkan Fest between the Super Saiyan 3 Goku and the Kid Buu. So once again, these guys are untranslated at the moment, but uh, they're just preparing them for release on Global, right? And uh, from there, we also have a few Dokkan Awakenings. This is the uh, Fizz... Is it Fizz? Mighty Mask? From the World Tournament, Dokkan Awakening, not ready yet, as well as some uh, Awakening Medals. So these, of course, are the... Dokkan Festival or Dokkan Event Medals for the Kid Buu as well as the Goku. And this is, uh, I believe, the Strike Medal for the Mighty Mask. I think, yeah. And then we also have the Extreme Z Awakening Medal for the LR Mighty Mask, or rather, uh, Kid Goten and Kid Trunks slash Mighty Mask that uh, are also, is also not ready for release at the moment. And uh, from there, we have a bunch of Mighty Mask medals. I'm assuming this is for an Extreme Z Awakening and uh, also some EZA medals for the Tech Free to Play Supreme Kai and also the uh, Int Gohan 
and Videl. Now, if I get some of the typings wrong, then I apologize because I don't remember exactly what type each of, these uh, each of these units are, but I think this guy's tech, I think these guys are int, and then I think these guys are either tech or fizz. But yeah, Extreme Z Awakening Medals for the free-to-play uh, Saiyan Mans as well. So there you go. And uh, after that, we have the untranslated logo for the LR uh, Goten and Trunks Extreme Z Battle. There's the Goten and Trunks themselves. We have a category tag, and I'm not 100% sure what this category is, but it's a new category that is not available on Global yet. And uh, we have an untranslated support memory with the GT Goku. We have some uh, new, ma new maps added to the Super Strike event, Mysterious Mask. So of course this would be for the free-to-play Mighty Mask. And we also have the token events for the uh, Kid Buu as well as the uh, Goku. These are their token event maps. And uh, this is a new map for stage 54 of Super Battle Road, which is for Worthy Rivals. And we also have some new ex uh, Extreme Z area stages for the Majin Buu Saga Extreme Z area event, stage 6, 7, and 8. And uh, after that, we also have a bunch of maps or a bunch of new stages for the Dragon Ball story. Um, and this time it's for Dragon Ball GT. So originally we had the uh, Dragon Ball Z one, right? Or is it just Saiyan Saga at the moment? I don't remember. But either way, we have the Dragon Ball story thing now since version Z came out, right? And uh, we didn't have anything aside from the first section. But now they're adding Dragon Ball GT. So... We have stage 1, 2, 3, and 4, along with stages 5, 6, 7, and 8, and finally stages 9 and 10. And I believe it's 3 difficulties per stage, if I remember correctly, so it should be something like 30 free dragon stones for this, although it could be 2, two difficulties, so maybe I remember that wrong. But either way, a good amount of free dragon stones just for completing this new section, this new Black Star Dragon Ball Saga section of the Dragon Ball story, so that's nice. And uh, they also made a few changes to some of the existing assets for some of the Dragon Ball Fusions units. So for the Tiancha and for the Weiris, apparently they changed Tiancha's belt and also adjusted Weiris' ears. And I don't know <laughs> exactly what difference would be there's no side by side here but um in case you guys are curious yeah so where is his ears i guess got changed somehow and uh the belt here was adjusted in some way maybe the color maybe uh, i don't know I, I guess it was just inaccurate before so they fixed that and uh, they also updated agl android 13's super attack chinese quote which uh is not something i would have known because i don't play the game in chinese but for those of you that cared, there you go. And uh, we have some new trade jewels, which are also not available yet. Now, this is a new blue dragon stone, which of course is going to be available for purchase at some point in the future. We also have a new uh, Dragon Ball Heroes collab dragon stone, which I guess is going to be for the next Heroes collab, which is not happening for a while. So I don't know why they have it so early, unless it's going to be like you know, a new Heroes collab sooner than expected. Hard to say, I'm not sure. I'm not sure about this one. And uh, we also have this snowman item. I don't remember exactly what this was for. And we have this uh, interesting dragon stone. I forgot what they called it, but essentially this is something you can collect um, leading up to the anniversary. And then they all get converted into actual dragon stones when the anniversary starts. So uh, yeah, we're about four months away, guys. So you don't have to worry about this too much, but that's basically what this item is. And after that, we have, uh, you know, the actual, like, in-game versions, I guess, of these assets, these uh, trade jewels. And we also have a million new story assets. So I'm not going to really highlight all of them. I'll just show you guys what they look like. We got the Goku. We got a bunch of uh, Pilaf new assets. Okay, we also have some more Pilaf assets. Oh, let me just uh, give you a better look here. These would actually be good for like thumbnails and stuff like that, so I'm gonna keep this in mind. I'm probably gonna save all of these. Okay, anyways, uh, new Goku, new Mighty Mask, a couple of Super Saiyan 3 Gokus right there, a couple of Kid Boos, a few uh, Dragon Ball GT 
assets. I'm assuming that these are going to be used for the new section of the Dragon Ball story, the Black Dragon Star, or sorry, <laughs> Black Dragon Star, the Black Star Dragon Ball, um, you know, story uh, stages. So there you go, a lot of GT Trunkses, GT Gokus, a couple of GT Pans right there. As you can see, a few more Super Saiyan GT Gokus. We got Legic, we got Muchi, we got Super Sigma 2, uh, Teen Oob, Lude, uh, Lude Pan Absorbed, uh, the Power Power Brothers, which are some of my personal favorite characters from GT, so I'm happy to see them. And uh, we also have Tsunama, we have Muchi Muchi, okay, and uh, Hyper Meta Rildo, Meta Rildo, uh, Super Sigma, <laughs> Nezi, Giru, um, and some My Data stuff. Okay, so this would be for the little Pixel Goku at the bottom of your My Data page. Uh, as you can see, it just goes through like the different forms of uh, Goku, the different stages that you'll see behind him as well as you progress through the levels. So uh, there's a quick look at those assets right there. And also some My Data category banners. Okay, so I'm definitely not going to show you all of these, but basically um, they're just like kind of headers for the various uh, titles, I guess, that you can get for the My Data page. So you got stuff like, you know, that's on battle, special titles, story titles, explosive chain battle titles, and then also one for each of the Extreme Z battle events as well. So you guys get the point. I don't think I have to scroll through all of them, but uh, yeah, they're all there for every single Extreme Z battle event in the game currently. And what else do we have? Okay, so scrolling through all the Extreme Z battle banners, we also have a untranslated Explosive Chain Battle Series 5 pack, which is also not available for release yet on Global. And that should do it for this data download, guys. Um, like I said, it, it, it is substantial. It was massive. There was a lot of data. So <laughs> this ended up being quite a bit longer than I was expecting, actually. But um, yeah, a bunch of this stuff is not ready yet. Of course, a lot of it is already in the game, like the LR Trunks Extreme Z Battles, the uh, or, or Extreme Z Battle slash Extreme Z area for the Prime Battle Trunks, as well as like the My Data stuff. Um, a lot of the assets, a lot of the data download was for the new update, so that was like a big part of it. But um, the Goku and Kid Boots will do a contest, as I said, is probably coming sometime in April, so that's something to look forward to for sure. We still don't know exactly what Saiyan Day has in store for us, so. Um, we should be getting that information very, very soon, within the next probably 24 hours. At least like the EZA that's coming up, but I can't say for sure, so we'll have to see. And uh, yeah, that is today's data download update, guys. Let me know in the comments what you guys are personally the most excited for out of like all the stuff we talked about here. I'm guessing most people will be saying it's the Super Saiyan 3 Goku, who is going to be a hard skip, man. He is so freaking good. He is so ridiculously powerful that like, I don't know, I would have a hard time skipping him, but obviously that depends on what Saiyan Day has in store, so we'll see. Um, I'm definitely very excited for Saiyan Day, definitely excited for the World Tournament, and uh, yeah, the LR Trunks Extreme Z Awakenings as well, of course. And once again, I'm doing a stream later today for this guy, so try to tune in if you can. Uh, if you can't, then it's all good because I will be... Uh, posting it as well so you can watch it anytime you want but that is today's data download guys uh big shout out and thank you once again to proton10mg for posting the assets this video would not be possible without him definitely go follow him and uh yeah as always if you guys liked today's video then make sure to like the damn video sub to the channel if you're new <coughs> excuse me um Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And uh, what else? There's something else I wanted to say, but I can't remember anymore. Uh, never mind. Uh, just have an awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out. <laughs>